I'd like to introduce you to the stupidest thing in our house. It probably didn't start a trash can. It didn't start out as a stupid idea because, I mean, there, you see? It's an automatic. You wave, wave around and then it uh, opens and closes all by itself. That's not the stupid thing about it. Uh, the thing is that sometimes it has a mind of its own. So just like walking by it, or we have three cats, and this thing will just go up and down, up and down, up and down. And when you want it to go up, it doesn't do it. So that's not that stupid. You know, that's just some technology, glitch in the technology. But the real stupid thing is, is the bag. Okay, it's got a, you put a, you put a bag in there, and this locks it down. But what there is, is there's a rim on the inside. So let's say, here's some coffee grounds that we could probably put in a compost. But, like, the bag doesn't come out because the rim around the top is smaller, or no, actually larger than the casing itself, the stainless steel casing. So it takes, like, if you have any kind of, yeah, if you have any kind of, like, a box or anything besides a tissue, what happens is the bag rips. So the people that designed this thing, the name of it is what? Envion, I-N-V-I-O-N. Stupid, stupid. Yeah, so, I mean, there it is. That's about as close as you get. And what happens is if you pull it any further out, like the top is already ripped apart, uh, it's an outdoor activity. So what I'm going to do is you carry the whole, the whole thing out and dump it in the trash. Stupid. So I don't know if you're going to be able to see this, but I'll, I'll, I'll get some other, other pictures of it. But the, the rim is about maybe a quarter to, uh, probably a, a, a little over a quarter uh, inch bigger than this. So it prevents the bag from coming out. Like once again, this wins the award. The stupidest thing we have in our house, and we've had it a couple of months, I dread taking the trash out, and it just doesn't work idiots that designed it.